I'm Debbie Henry Davis and welcome to the back of the car where we're showing you all of our favourite car seats, instructional videos, how to fit them in your car. So we were asked this morning to show you how to fit a Maxi Crazy Pebble Pro in the back of the car if you don't have Isofix. Do check out the other video that we've done that shows you how to find your Isofix. We'll try and put a card up to show you where that is as well. But if you don't have Isofix and you want to pop it in with a seatbelt, this is how to do it safely and securely. So pop your seat on your car, making sure it's nice and level. You do need to make sure when you're fitting this in the car that your handle is in the upright position. You don't have to attach your hood, but you do need to make sure your hood, your handle is up. So then we're going to take our seatbelt and we're going to pop it across the seat. Now I always recommend if you're fitting this, get a mat, particularly if you've got leather seats, because it will stop a little bit of slippage, but it is important to make sure that you get this nice and tight. When you go across here, if you don't pull it tight, you've got all this slack here, which will mean you'll get a lot of movement. So the easiest way to do this is pull it nice and firmly from here. Can you see how much I'm pulling out of that belt? There's quite a lot. If I do it again, so we've popped it across like that, and now look how much belt I'm actually pulling out just by pulling it tightly. And this is the key to getting a really nice secure fit. And then we've got to take it around the back of the seat and on the back of the seat here, you've got a little clip here, which you will slide your belt through and that stops it coming apart. Make sure that it's nice and level in the car and then just give it another tug to make sure that it's nice and securely in. Now, if you feel this now, it should be very solid and you can test it like this. If you've got lots of movement, you haven't fitted it securely and chances are you haven't tightened your belts enough. So it should fit just as securely as if you were putting it on a base. When you take it out of the car, just do it in reverse. If you've got lock off seatbelts like I have, you will probably need to undo it first. So just then take your seatbelts back out, undo it, and then undo your seatbelts from here. So that is how to fit your Maxi Cozy Pebble Pro in the back of a car using a seatbelt option. I hope you found this helpful. If you are watching on our YouTube channel, we'd love it if you gave us a thumbs up. If you want to leave some feedback, we always really appreciate it. And if you want to subscribe to our page and get the rest of our fitting videos, just click the bell icon above and we'll send you them as we record them. Thanks for joining us once again today.